So I could tell you guys, I'm pretty sure I would not have won this competition. This is the hunting division, and the decoys, the whole point is you're supposed to blend in, you look like a real animal. Uh -huh. I don't think Steve and I did a very good no. job, especially for me in this bright, very bright, like, blue-green. But that's okay. So if you need a real decoy, this is the place you need to go. The happening this weekend is the Pacific Fly Wildfowl Art Classic. That mouth. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, wait, it's there. the highway, one of many. For the animals. <laughs> oh, have you guys, you guys knew what that was? Pacific Flyaway? Yes. Oh, so here we have, so some of the things that are going to be happening, there's all these sorts of demonstrations. You'll see guys like Mike here and next to Bob who have almost 100 years worth of carving experience between them. Mike's been doing this for 30. Bob's been doing it for 40, he told me. And the whole goal is they carve these beautiful, beautiful birds that look so realistic. Ooh. They do um, look so And, you realistic. know, there's different styles and stuff. But th that's also having days. So you can see them at work. And then for the kitties, you can wondering I feel like this is what draws them the animals oh. this is Murphy Murphy is a vet we met Murphy last year uh, Murphy's molting in case you're wondering so if we get close enough you probably want to freak freak uh, Murphy out but you can see some of the feathers coming off slowly Ooh. and then right next to Murphy is Whisper Whisper, Whisper is a brand new baby barn owl <laughs> Whisper was born in April. I don't have to whisper. To... Oh, Whisper's getting down? Yeah. Whisper's, yeah. Dancing. whisper's like, hey, <laughs> you chill. I love that. So all this stuff is happening. <laughs> so I want to talk before we go away. It was with Jim. Jim helps coordinate and organize all this stuff. One of the neat things you're telling me about is this art form is one of five original American art forms. Right. Uh, uh -oh. Original American art forms. It comes from no other culture. It comes from no other continent. Um, when the European settler uh, came to settle in the Chesapeake Bay area, they saw the Indians carving uh, or actually making reed decoys. And the, these European settlers knew how to make good working, woodworking skills. And so what they did was they took an axe and they started chopping very crude um, wooden blocks that looked like a duck. And they would float them along the shoreline and they would harvest the uh, ducks for food at the table. And so uh, this art form is unique to America. It's part of our heritage. And it's uh, one of those things that you walk into a stranger's house and you see an old decoy on the shelf. And that's because it's part of us. That's amazing. So if you guys are interested, this event is happening all weekend. Today is the first day. So come check it out. Lots of things happening, as you saw. Yes. Cool. Yeah, I encourage you to check it out because it is really neat to see them. And I'm loving Whisper. Yeah. Yeah, I've been there a couple times uh, doing live shots mm -hmm. as well. And uh, just the coolest people, just really mm -hmm. chilled and relaxed, mm -hmm. really into their craft. It's yeah. really neat.